Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. I've um, got a question for anyone out there today, really. I've got this Spitfire behind me, Triumph Spitfire 1970, whatever, that I've been working on for a while now. Um, we're getting there, we've got about halfway through the bodywork on the body. Chassis outside, and it's been outside the whole time. The chassis is okay, the engine, it runs, but it doesn't look great. But I've seen a couple people on the internet who have put the running gear from a Mazda MX-5 in a Triumph Spitfire and it looks really good and um, I haven't looked into it to see if it's worth doing but I want to know if, if anyone's watching this or following this if they would be interested in that in me doing that because I'm quite interested in doing that I think it'd be quite a cool car in the long run I personally I'd like to get in the Spitfire and it'd be a complete Mazda pretty much inside when you sit in with the Mazda dashboard I, I know that sounds quite hard work but I'd really like that I'd like to get in the car and it'd be modern and I know you can get um, supercharger kits for those MX-5s as well which would be pretty cool um, yeah prizes for anyone guessing what the next project is it's under that cover so here here's what we're working with so this is the engine from the, uh, the Mazda it's a uh, 1.8 litre just four cylinder but I think it's got about 100 and 30, 140 brake horsepower. I, I might be wrong there, correct me, but um, yeah, which is a lot, lot more than what's um, in the uh, the original 1.3 Spitfire engine. The more I keep thinking about it, the more I keep thinking this could actually work. Um, I haven't measured anything up, but we'll, well, I'll show you that engine there. That's the engine from the MX-5. Here's the engine for the Spitfire. I really do apologize for the wind today. Yeah, it's a little bit shorter as engines go, it's, it's probably about half the length, but we've got all of this room at the front still. I mean, the bonnet does come down, obviously. But I, th I, th I honestly think it will fit. Um, it would be nice to get all the suspension and stuff off of the uh, the Mazda, but I don't think that will work. Um, I need to look into the whole project a bit more. I just want to know your thoughts. Sorry about how dark it is in here. There was um, a storm a couple of days ago, and I've got no power in here. It'll be coming back, I'm sure. But this is the Spitfire. The idea would be, that down there. It would be great if you could get in here, and all of that would be the interior from the MX-5. So yeah, that's um, that's just something I've been thinking about doing. Um, I think it'd be a really cool car if I could if I could pull it off. I just want to know what you guys think. If anyone thinks it's it's worth me doing and they'd like to watch that, then. Um, yeah, let me know. Um, and if you if you think it's a terrible idea, please let me know. Because um, at the moment, I'm really talking myself into doing it. So please let me know if you think it's crap. Um, yeah, thank you very much.